a very good morning to everyone and welcome back to the online classes so now let's start with the revision of the first terminal exam now we will understand the concept of subtraction without borrowing and with borrowing so question 6 is subtraction according to the paper style so now here we have written the question now all of you should remember one thing very clearly that in subtraction always the bigger number will come first so now we are writing all the bigger numbers first as you can see over here all the bigger numbers are first and then the comes the smaller numbers so now let's start with the first question hundreds tens and ones 987 minus 324 so 7 minus 4 so we are at 4 5 6 7 7 so how many fingers are there three fingers we'll write three over here 8 minus 2 3 4 5 6 7 7 and 8 so 6 and 9 minus 3 4 5 6 7 8 and 9 so how many are there six Now the second question is seven hundred and thirty-two minus two hundred and twelve. So again, two minus two is zero. Three minus one, one, two, and three. That is two. And seven minus two, three, four, five, six, seven. That is five. Now let's move on to the third question: hundreds, tens, and ones. Seven hundred and eighty-four minus two hundred and twenty-one. Four minus one, one, two, three, and four. Three, then eight minus two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight, so six. Then seven minus two, three, four, five, six, and seven, so five. Now the last, the fourth question: hundred, tens, and ones. Five hundred minus two hundred. Zero minus zero is zero. Zero minus zero is zero. Five minus two. Three, four, and five. So three. Three is our answer. So now let's practice subtraction with borrowing. So now we have some questions written over here. For example, six thousand three hundred and eighty-two and two thousand seven hundred and forty-five. Now here you can see that the word and is coming, and the first number is bigger than the second one. So obviously we will write the first number over here. So thousands, hundreds, tens, and ones. Six thousand three hundred and eighty-two and two thousand seven hundred and forty-five. Now let's start the calculation. Now two minus five, two is small, five is big. So what we'll do? We need to borrow. So we'll cancel this and make this twelve. Cancel this eight and make this seven. Now it has become big. So twelve minus five. So five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. So seven. Now seven minus four, four, five, six, and seven, three. Now three minus seven. So here again, you can see that three is small, seven is big. So what we are going to do? We will borrow. So we are borrowing from six. So first we'll make this thirteen, and we'll cancel this six and make this five. Since we have borrowed one from six. Now thirteen minus seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, and thirteen. This is six. And five minus two, two, three, four, and five. So three. Now the sixth question is two thousand seven hundred and nine from eight thousand and five. Now here the word and was there, and here you can see that the bigger number was written first. But here you can see that the smaller number is written first, and from is written, and eight thousand and five. So. From eight thousand and five, we have to subtract two thousand seven hundred and nine. So let's start thousands, hundreds, tens, and ones. Now eight thousand and five minus two thousand seven hundred and nine. Now five is big. So nine is big and five is small. So what we have to do? So we have to make five bigger than nine. So we'll cancel this and we'll make this fifteen. Now you can see that the next number is zero. Now zero cannot. Bo give anything, so we can't borrow anything from zero. So we'll make this nine, and again we can see a zero over here. Again, zero cannot give us anything; it has no value. So now again we'll make it nine over here. Now over here, this is eight, so we'll make this seven. So actually we have borrowed from eight. So always remember, whenever we have a zero, we cannot borrow from zero. So we have to keep moving. 
till we get to the number. Now 15 minus 9, so 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, so 6. Now 9 minus 0 is 9, 9 minus 7, so 7, 8 and 9, 2, then 7 minus 2, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and 7, 5. Now 5852 and 2437. So here again you can see the word and is given which means that the first number is given is bigger than the second number. We will simply start writing thousands, hundreds, tens and ones. Now 5852 minus 2437. Now let's start calculating. Now you can see 7 is big, 2 is small. So we will make this 12 and we will cancel this 5 and make this 4. Now 12 minus 7, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 and 12, so 5. Then 4 minus 3 is 1. 8 minus 4, 4, 5, 6, 7 and 8, so 4. And then 5 minus 2, so 2, 3, 4 and 5, so 3. So 3415 is the answer. And now 3188 from 7372. Again, thousands, hundreds, tens and ones. Now you can see that the word from is given and you can even see that the bigger number is written second. So we will write 7372 minus 3188. So now let's start calculating. Now you can see 2 is small, 8 is big. Let's borrow, make this 12 and cancel this and make this 6. So 12, 8, 9, 10, 11 and 12, 4. Then again you can see 6 is small and 8 is big. So let's borrow, make this 16 and make this 2. So 16. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 and 16. So 8. Then 2 minus 1 is 1. Then 7 minus 3, 4, 5, 6 and 7 and 4. So now this was um, practice of uh, subtraction. Now we will practice next question. Now let's practice solving of these numbers. Now question number 9, 3845 minus 2690 plus 2415. So now as you can see over here, there is a subtraction sign also given and addition is also given. Now what we'll do over here, we will first add the two numbers and then from the answer we will subtract this number. So let's start writing first. So we'll write 3000. So now 3845, so 5 at the 1's place, 4 at the 10's place, 8 at the 100's place and 3 at the 1000's place, plus sign. Now 2415, so 5 at the 1's place, 1 at the 10's place, 4 at the 100's place and 2 at the 1000's place. So now 5 plus 5 is 10, so 0 stays down, 1 goes up, 4 plus 1 is 5, 5 plus 1 is 6, then 8 plus 4, 8. 9, 10, 11 and 12. So 2 stays down and 1 goes up. So 3 plus 1 is 4, 4 plus 2 is 6. Now 6260 and minus 2690. So from the answer we subtract this. So 6260 so we will write over here 0 at the 1's place, 6 at the 10's place, 2 at the 100's place and 6 at the 1000's place. Now minus sign 2690, so 0 at the 1's place, 9 at the 10's place, 6 at the 100's place and 2 at the 1000's place. So now shall we start subtracting? Yes, 0 minus 0 is 0, now 6 minus 9, so 6 is small, 9 is big, so let's borrow, let's make this 16, let's cancel this 2 and make this 1. Now 16. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 and 16. So 7. Now 1 minus 6. So again 1 is small, 6 is big. So we will make this 11. We will cancel this 6 and make this 5. So 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 and 11. So 5. And 5 minus 2, 3, 4 and 5. So 3. Now the next question, number 10. 
2789 plus 3415 minus 1980. So, here again, we will first add these two numbers and from the answer we will subtract. So, let's start doing it. So, we'll write thousands, hundreds, tens and ones. Now, 2789, so 9 at the 1's place, 8 at the 10's place, 7 at the 100's place and 2 at the 1000's place, plus sign, 5 at the 1's place, 1 at the 10's place, 4 at the 100's place, 3 at the 1000's place, then 9 plus 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 4 stays down, 1 goes up, 8 plus 1 is 9, 9 plus 1 is 10, 0 stays down, 1 goes up, 7 plus 1 is 8, 8, 9, 10, 11 and 12, 12, 2 stays down, 1 goes up, 2 plus 1 is 3 and 3 plus 3 is 6, so now 6204, now again, thousands, hundreds, tens and ones, now our answer is not complete because we have to do the subtraction also, so now 4 at the ones place, 0 at the tens place, 2 at the hundreds place and 6 at the thousands place, don't forget the minus sign. Now 0 at the 1's place, 8 at the 10's place, 9 at the 100's place and 1 at the 1000's place. 4 minus 0 is 4. Now 0 minus 8, we can't do it. So let's borrow, make this 10 and cancel this 2 and make this 1. 10 minus 8, 8, 9 and 10, 2. Then 1 minus 9, again not possible. So we'll make this 11 and cancel this 6 and make this 5. So 9, 10 and 11, 2, then 5 minus 1, 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5, so 4.